my, oh my, a butterfly. I'm Cat in the Hat. If you look at the, in the sky, you might see a butterfly fluttering by. They're kind of colourful insects who lives you will see are very exciting. Come follow me. Right here out of doors, you if you might if you look you might spot spot a butterfly egg, its little round dot. It sticks to a leaf, rain won't wash it away. Right here on this leaf is where it wants to stay. You may think in these eggs are small butterflies, but wait till they hatch and you'll get a surprise. Caterpillars hatch out of the butterfly eggs. They look like small worms and ha may have 16 legs. They start chewing and growing and growing and chewing. And that's about all they spend their time doing. They eat first their eggshell, then that until it's le then its leaves that they need. That they eat all the time and they grow with great speed. This caterpillar has grown too big for its skin. It needs a bit bigger skin than the skin has been in. So it takes a deep breath, then it wobbles and wiggles, and its, and its skin starts to split as it juggles and jiggles. The old skin falls off, and right there underneath is new, bigger skin that has been hiding beneath. It eats the old skin Oh, yum, how delicious. Protein in the skin makes it very nutritious. nutritious. After the fourth time it sheds its, all its skin, the next stage of a butterfly's life will begin. It hangs upside down like a small letter J, and for a few hours it hangs there that way. Then it changes again, the next stage it is this a shell forms around it called a chrysalis. Chrysalis. Inside the chrysalis, the caterpillar keeps changing. All of its body parts are rearranging. For almost 10 days, it can't move and can't eat. Then one day, the butterfly changes its change is complete. A tiny black leg begins to poke through. Within seconds, another leg pops into view. She bursts into the air, a bright new butterfly. Her wings are so soft that, that at first she can't fly. She mu must wait till they harden. Till then, she must stay. If an enemy comes, she cannot fly away. Her antennas start working to sense what's around her, the motions, the smells and the sights that surround her. In hours her new wings get harder so she's ready to fly, she's ready to go. See these two caterpillars, they're different, here's why. One will soon be a moth, one a bright butterfly, one makes a chrysalis and now we we know inside is a but a butterfly starting to grow. One spins a cocoon like a blanket to hide in, and then a new moth begins to grow inside it. Spiders, frogs, beetles, birds, lizards, and mice think bright butterflies for a snack are quite nice. Every butterfly knows a bird are trying to catch it. It's its wobbly flight makes it hardest to snatch it. This butterfly colours warn foes it, it might meet. I'm poisonous, I'll hurt you. I'm not good to eat. Some cover their bright wings with dark wings, you see. These help them to blend with trees on a lee. tree. Butterflies are so light. This will show you how many you'll need just to equal the weight of a penny. There See, they see thousands of pictures. If one looks at me, here's a drawing of what it would see. We have a new hobby. We just started trying. It's fun and it's free. It's called butterflying. We're, we just look to find butterflies. They're everywhere, out of the doors, near a stream, on the ground, in the air. 
We write down the day and the time we saw them. We write down the place and take crowns and draw them. When you find butterflies, there are ways you can see by sizes, shape and colors what kind they might be. Butterflies get their names from all different things. Swallowtail butterflies have long tails on their wings. Here's a lace wing. Its wing look like lace. Um, this owl butterfly looks like a baby owl's face. Which is, a, is the smallest? Is a pygmy blue. A bird wing is the largest. It's, a, it's beautiful too. These are monarchs. Just watch them in flight. They have orange and black wings with sm small dots of white. They can't live in cold weather, so somehow they know they must fly where it's warmer, like Mexico. They fly hundreds of miles. They fly hundred hours and hours. They stop just to rest and sip nectar from a flowers. Monarchs hide in, st in a storm when thunder is crashing they know they're in danger when lightning is flashing how do these butterflies know where they're going scientists really have no way of knowing butterflies can be tagged to show where they're from this way we can learn how far they've come this one is from maine i think it's really cool it was tagged by kids at a let me school Monarchs fly for weeks till they find see in me, in a, the Mexico forest and or a male tree. They fly to the tree and ju then just before dark they land and they hook their small legs in the bark. Without the sun's warmth, they're too cold for flight, so they huddle together to wait at the night. In the, in the spring, when it's warmer, monarchs lift off from the trees. They flutter, they swoop, and they dance in the breeze. Now that is warmer, these butterflies know they must mate and lay eggs so the new babies can grow. Once a female has made it, it's too hard to go on. She will not ling, live much longer, her time almost gone. She is carrying eggs that... that they are heavy. That's why she cannot get home. It's too far to fly. So she searches for leaves and lays eggs. One by one, she lays hundreds of eggs and won't stop till that she's done. Butterflies are surprising and beautiful things. As they soar through the air and on, bright, on their bright colored wings, they're like jewels in the sun. They live just a short while. And wherever you see one, you can't help but smile. For you know on a leaf, for you know on a leaf, if you look, you might find an egg that a butterfly just left behind. And in that egg, small as the head of a pin, a new butterfly's life is about to be... If you know how to find all our stories, go to YouTube and type Flipping Books for World Changes into the search bar. Click Go, then select Living Books for World Changes and Videos, and then all our stories are there. We upload new stories every Thursday, so please come back. We love reading stories for you. Come back and listen.